Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to Shen Plays. I'm your host, Shenra, and today we are playing The Pope. Here in the opener, Seriously, four. though, I'm just considering, like, hooking up OBS, face cam, and, uh, you know, just making, like, 20 minutes of me reading the three pages of fan fiction that's been written. This is our war. It doesn't look like that much, and since Castile and England are helping us, it probably won't be that bad. We've won pretty much all the battles, and uh, we're currently sieging up Venice and Liguria. We have a mission to take Liguria, so hopefully we can do that. That'd be nice. We have a claim on Liguria, so the cost to take it will be a little cheaper than normal, and the cost to core it will certainly be cheaper than normal. It's too bad we can't vassalize that idiot, but um, since he owns Kaffa over here, and Kaffa's a base 6 tax, it costs too much to vassalize him in war. It's very unfortunate, but oh well. In the meantime, we're just kind of taunting Venice because he doesn't have enough units to deal with our armies, so he can watch at us from his island, but he can't really do anything about it. So screw you, Venice. Brittany apparently has some civil disorder going on. Congratulations, Brittany, who is... <laughs> Brittany is reformed, okay. Mm, Naples is in a coalition against us. Hopefully they'll go away. We don't really need them in a coalition against us. Uh, Bavaria likes us. That's good. Let's keep relations high with all of Europe. I want Europe to like us. Well, by Europe, I mean the HRE. HRE needs to like us. We want all the things to like us. Why do we have eight relationships? Holy crap. Alliance with Savoy, alliance with Castile, and alliance with England. Wow. And we're guaranteeing Naples. Oh, that's right. Guaranteeing counts as one. That sucks. Stupid Castile, leave him alone. He's my 63-year-old creepy cardinal. Leave him alone. I wonder if just sieging Liguria will be enough to demand it from them. I hope so. We have a mission to take it. I want to be able to take it. It'd be nice. Even England's down here with dudes. Look at this. And it looks like Castile is getting enough troops together to crush France's army. So that's nice. Ideally, we would make them give up three provinces to our vassal. And then we could just annex our vassal. That'd be great. That'd be great. Where do I live? I live in San Francisco. It's a very nice area. The religious map, I've shown it like a billion times. There it is. So many Protestants. And France. Basically it's just Protestants, France, and then Catholics kind of mixed in, and then Orthodoxy and Sunni. And that's it. Big old battle over here. Hopefully France will lose that. Looks like they are. Oh, it seems close. And Treviso fell. Nice. Do we have enough boats to get to Venice? We have how many boats? 27. And he has... Maybe. I'm not sure if our navy can deal with him. Uh, he probably has an admiral too. He does. Mm, I'm willing to give it a shot though. Give it a shot. Let's see if we can actually handle his navy. That would be epic if we could actually get over there and do something cool. I think we'll wait until the Guri is done, and then we'll transfer that idiot over here. And go fight him in Treviso. Not Treviso, uh, Friuli. Okay, bulb that. We need one more bulb, and then uh, this penalty won't be so bad. I might not have... Might have been a bad idea to bulb that during a war, but whatever. Let's get rid of our guarantee down here. Just get some more uh, points coming in. Thirty-five percent down there. That's good. Castile loves us. England loves us. Burgundy. Chen, something to do with your hand. fleet. Why about my fleet? Like apparently your fleet may be wiped out because your opponent has galleys. Yeah, but he only has ten galleys, and we have twenty-six light ships. I think we'll be okay. Hmm. 
Just figured I'd warn you because some people in the chat were screaming at you. Yep. Oh, here they go. The fleet came out to fight us, and it looks like they are going to beat us. Aw, oh, man. We will do our valiant best. Well, at least I tried, guys. Sorry. <laughs> we'll do our best. We didn't win. Damn. It was worth a shot, though. We only lost one boat. So this is kind of nice right now because there's this coalition against us, right? And it's just Naples. There's no one else in the coalition because everyone else in the coalition is already at war with us. So if we want to go vassalize Naples, I think now is the time, right during this war. Yeah, it seems reasonable, or maybe at the tail end of it once you're uh, pretty much done with this one. Like just before you make peace, you declare the uh, other war. Yeah, maybe. And we just destroyed half of Venice's army. So let's get access through Austria, assuming they will. We can go siege up Dalmatia and Istria and stuff like that. Nah, they won't give us access. Damn it. Oh, they just set us hostile. Mm -mm, damn it. They were intimidated or threatened by us, and now they're hostile. Damn it. Not sure if we actually need to go invade France, but we might. Uh, Castile's sort of doing it, but there's also leaving some idiots back home. And England doesn't seem to be doing anything. They're blockading France, that's it. Eh. All right, yeah, let's uh, let's declare war on Naples. They got no allies, no nothing. Oh, we don't have a CB. Shit. Get me a freaking CB already. How do we not have a CB? My goodness. Agent discovered. Oh, we took him out of our stupid list, didn't we? Uh, yeah. And someone just stole some shit. Hey, give it back, you bastards. He's mine. I saw him first. Well, if we don't have the CB yet, then come over here. Defeat them on the field of honor. Oh, they're retreating. Follow them. Damn it, Castile. I thought we were allies. Uh, so all this war score is going to be from battles, right? Oh no, we actually have a lot of war score from owning Provence. Okay, and we also have some blockade war score. Cool, so England's actually helping out with the blockades. I like that. I didn't think it would actually be beneficial, but it is. And there's Catholic zealots too. So there's still hope for um, France to remain Catholic, but who knows. Oh, AI, you silly... He always does this. It's so 
skittery and weird. Awkward. He's going to try to run around us by going to Wallace. Hmm. Interesting. I'm not sure what he's doing. Oh! Oh, shoot. I didn't realize they were fighting or else I could have gone and helped. Her. Nah, don't, don't risk it right now. Um. So is that going to be enough to get what we want? No. So we are actually going to have to do more than just that. Maybe blockade them a little bit? Hmm. Not sure. Oh crap, he's going to make it to Brescia first, so he's going to be defending the mountains, which is not ideal. Hmm. We do have an ass load of cannons, though. Nope. Go this way. It's gonna be a big rumble. Oh, we caught them first. Cool. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Damn it, damn it. Um, you. I can't even afford to do the other guy, so you. We have allies coming to help over here, so that's nice. And our cannons are helping out a ton here. He's going this way. Alright. Hopefully he'll just stop there and die. Yeah, he stopped. Cool. Oh my god. Lombard Patriots. Counting 13. Wow. All I want is your capital, dude. That's it. Seventy-two percent on uh, the causes belly down here. Good. Freely fell. Very nice. And they won't give us access, will they? Nope. Hostile. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Rolling zeros. Good job. Love rolling zeros. Our general's better than his, and we're still rolling shit. That is a gruesome battle, Jesus. Wow. We're still fighting, still rolling zeros. Both guys rolled zeros, and then we rolled another zero, and then another zero. Three zeros in a row. Oh, yeah. That's the shit I like. Three zeros in a row. That's how we're going to win this war. Three zeros. And a one. Three zeros, and then a one. Come on. What kind of shit is this crap? <sighs> Three zeros and a one. Okay, we got a little war score for it, but still, three zeros and a one. Come on. Okay, we got our CB on Naples. Good. And Venice has returned. Okay. He's like, we're going to get our land back. Or not. I 
running to Nice. Interesting. Okay, let's go play in Modena then. Whatever. Savoy peaced out. Because <laughs> they had some soldiers stand on their land. They're like, oh god, soldiers, let's peace out. Uh, Holland. Do you guys want out of the war? I mean, I'm sure you're being blockaded. No, he's, he's close, but not yet. Okay. <laughs> papal vassal. <laughs> we can make him a papal vassal if we get 88% on him. <laughs> wow. Not quite ready for that, are you, Holland? The chat would like to report to you that you have a free merchant and you are losing money. You should ratify both at the same time. I don't care about the money. Uh, the free or merchant rectify, is sorry. Genoa. Okay, collect. Collect. Okay. So he's just going to return home. We'll send the smaller army after him. And the bigger army can come down here. And free diplomats as well. Herbadurbadur. Herbadurbadur. Hungary, you're at war with Bavaria. Bohemia, you probably want an alliance, don't you? Yeah, you do. Burgundy, you still have us as a rival. Uh, Portugal, you probably would love an alliance. Let's get relations up a bit. And let's declare war on this idiot. What's he going to do about it? Yo, I'm here to declare war. No one else can join you in your coalition of crap. Your coalition of crap! And uh, that means we can peace out other people in the coalition now. I wish he would just give me this province. Peace offer value 50. Why won't you give me your province? Come on, man. It's not too much to ask. I'm going to build... Well, no, I can't build a ship. Can I? can I peace out Venice? That would help. I mean, we're winning heavily over here. But he won't give me anything. He can't really release anything, can he? Well, he could, but he won't. I uh, return a court of Byzantium. He will. Only one province. Hmm... Too bad Austria won't give us access. But yeah, I do think we need to piece out Venice. It's going to have to be a separate peace deal. It's going to be absolute crap. Uh, just take money, maybe. I like money. And uh, return your core. He will. <sighs> I wish we could get them to release uh, Croatia, but he won't. So we'll just do that. That gets Venice out of the war, and that means now we can bring our navy around to blockade uh, Genoa and maybe get that war done. Right? I'm hoping. And France is having trouble. Good, let's go help out over there. Trouble. These stupid Sicilian... Patriots won't do jack shit. Look at this. They're, they're still in exile mode. So broken. Why is my game broken? <laughs> Excuse me, my game is broken. Okay, drop a siege and go. I said drop a siege and go. Drop a siege. You can let them go there. That's fine. And drop another siege. And you can just go home. Actually, you can help in the capital. <sighs> okay, so now we're down to just uh, Brittany, Holland, and Genoa. And we are blockading Corsica. Maybe he will give it now? Nope. We actually have to send some troops over. So let's build a couple transports. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. That should be enough, right? Maybe? Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We'll build ten. I don't care about taking out a loaner suit. No big deal. Oh, we're fighting their navy. 
Maybe he'll surrender once we've destroyed his navy? I just want to take his capital, that's all. It's not too much to ask, is it? Come on. Be a gent. Give me your capital. Wouldn't want to embarrass you, man. Okay, we destroyed his navy. That's nice. <laughs> now do you want peace after you have no more navy? Nope. He don't care. I'm like, fuck you. User in your channel timed out. Um, interesting. Apparently the attrition down here is bad enough that our troops are melting. Oh no, it's because we have no manpower left. Okay, well that'll do it. Shit. No manpower. Spain's making nice work up here. I approve. Can we make them return course to my vassal? Let's see how much they're actually willing to do. He will. He'll do all three. Oh, that's fantastic. I can bulb another idea. Ah, the last military idea. Discipline plus 10% and forced march. Hell yeah. That's so nice. I'm really hoping Castile doesn't just peace out here. Because they might. We'd lose a lot of war score if they did. Making progress in Bari, very nice. I mean, not Bari, Naples. Napoli. <laughs> Napoli! You do know uh, Genoa moved their capital to Corsica, right? No, I didn't see that. Why would they do that? Fuck, I know. But they did it. The base tax there is only three. Probably it's counted Ligeria is surrounded by enemies or something. Hmm. That's really odd. Either way, it should be easier to take now. Let me take a look. Oh, you think they moved it during the war? Oh, it's still the same cost. Well, we almost have some transports now. Votes will finish in September. Okay, good. October. Okay. Five transports. We have a few more building, huh? Okay. Hurry up. <laughs> Build them. Forty-eight percent. Damn it. <laughs> damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Finishes in December. Okay. First of December. We can head over there with a general.
Kill them all. God damn it. Castile pieced out. They took Baron. God damn it, the timing is just so bad. We do still have good war score, and I don't think he has much in the line of soldiers, so we might as well help invade. But come on, that was so close. We had just landed troops down there. Okay, Naples is going to vassalize. Good. Can I make you revoke cores? Yeah, okay, good. Vassalize, revoke cores, give me some money. We're good. Okay, new vassal. I'm happy. Go to Rome. Holland does not want peace. Who the hell is in this? Uh, Brittany. Brittany, you want peace. Yeah, Brittany wants peace. Oh, wow. He, yes, he wants peace. Alright, just white peace out, Brittany. Bye-bye. zeros and still winning. Cool. Now he'll give me his capital. Okay. And some money? I like money. I don't have enough Diplo points. I need <laughs> nine more Diplo points. Or eleven more Diplo points. Damn it. Whatever. Let's invade France. Hello again. Welcome back. I'm invading France. And my people are a little unhappy with Spain for getting that separate peace deal, let me tell you. Have you peaced out Brittany yet? Yep. Yeah. It's just France and Holland now. Someone's trying to steal a cardinal. Hell no. Get the hell out of here, Burgundy. Shit's mine. I call dibs and everything. Problem we have right now is we have no manpower. Like, zero. So hopefully we can get a lot of this shit done without any manpower. Uh, how are we doing so far? We have 32 from battles and 23 from owning um, the target province. Good. A new cardinal from the Pope. Uh, can we get anyone else? Yeah, we'll go get that guy from Poland. Just roll over and die, Poland. No one cares what you think, Poland. Oh my god, we're going to need so many Diplo points. Uh, oh my god. We, need <laughs> we have too many alliances right now. We, we, we Oh my goodness. We have so many alliances right now. Caught France's army. Good. Do we have? Oh, we have. Th we have enough points to demand the capital. Thank goodness. 
There are no diplomats to send. Well, come the hell home then. I'm gonna be home next month, that's fine. Next month they return. Oh my goodness. Okay, Catholic Zealots. I'm not sure I want to take that away from Catholic Zealots. But whatever. And Naples is now coming up to help us. Nice. Alright, let's talk about Liguria. Thank you. Give me some money. Money, money. Okay. Liguria is ours. Oh, fantastic. We can convert it. Can we? How much does it cost? Yeah, we'll convert it. We'll core it later. How long is that claim good until? Uh, eight more years on the claim, and it's not going to take that long to core it, right? I mean, to convert it. Five years in a Okay, that's fine. We don't need these boats, do we? Extra transports? Nah. Go home. You guys can quit that transport. Too many transports. Five is plenty, or six, or whatever we have. Go back to Rome. Actually, just stay there. Okay, okay, we now have Liguria. And that was our mission. What else can we get for a mission? Friends, reclaiming Ferrara? We're going to integrate Ferrara soon, dude. Uh, enemy of enemy, Austria. I don't know about that. They don't like us. Probably not going to happen. Uh, what can we do with France? Well, the problem with France is we need... Uh, how many? We need 150 Diplo points. So we're just going to have to sit on this war for a while. He's willing to give us the peace deal. But... Um, we're not going to be able to do it until we have the Diplo points. Let's put the speed all the way up to max. And just unpause. Just let shit go. Mm, more military power points. I like that. Siege all the things. Ah, the Voyager Order wants access. No, you don't need it. <laughs> you don't need it. England has still not pieced out. Interesting. England has rebels. Well, that's normal. England usually has rebels. England's good at rebels. And France just lost their army to that stack of rebels. Awesome. What are you going to offer me? Um, give Cor Dauphine to Provence. Give Cor Anjou to Provence. Give Cor Maine to Provence. He's willing to do it for me, even though I don't have the points. Uh, annul treaties with Genoa, pay 105 ducats. Perfect! He's giving me exactly what I want. Yay, my vassal got huge. Oh, now, now, we, now our troops are trapped in Anju. <laughs> our troops are seriously trapped in Anju. Wow. Um, if we get access... Oh, we can. Okay, good. <laughs> okay, well, go down there and help out. You guys go home. So my vassal got a lot bigger. He still has one more core that he can get up here in Baroy, but I'm not sure if that's ever, ever going to happen. But we do need to end this episode here. So thank you guys for joining me today. I have been Shen. You have been you. And somehow that 150 Diplo power peace deal didn't cost us anything at all. That's really awkward. Hey, I'll take it. I'll see you guys next time. Have a good day.